Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I am going to teach you how to design a simple punch and die for this stamping pot. So, let's get started. First go to assembly. First we have to import our stamping pot. So here click insert components. So for this stamping part we need die first. So click here and click new part and name it as die. To get the die block we have to extract the surface from this stamping part. So just click the die and make it edit go to surface click offset surface right click here and click select tangency so the entire surface will be copied click enter zero click it the surface we got now hide the bend and here the surface we have to develop for our die so just click here extend surface you can click the edges or else you can click the face also so here you can click face around 30 is enough now the surface is created so now we have to make a die block so just click here top lane click unhide the pot so we can sketch a rectangle so this rectangle we have to make sure the center of this pot so just click here click center line click this part and drag here the line so you, you will get the center point just click it and make it horizontal the same click center line click here and hover over the line click here click this and make it vertical so if you extend this rectangle it will only goes in same dimension in both sides click smart dimension this is rough only so you can give the dimension as it is 75 ok exit sketch go to features click extrude boss here click offset reverse the direction here click up to the surface here you can see the die is getting ready just click ok and hide the surface now you got the die block so just um, make some appearance click here click this part for any color you want to give you can give just click this then we have to make a punch for this stamping part so exit this edit part and add again new part rename it as punch click this click this edit part and now 
we don't have to take surface again for this punch because we already have a surface so we just copy the surface and make a make our punch so first we have to measure the thickness the thickness is 2 mm for this part so we have to offset the surface for 2 mm make sure the punch is edited now go to surface offset surface just click this surface if doesn't means just drop down the tree and click here surface 2 mm the surface going downwards so reverse the direction now it is good click it now hide that die also so you won't get confused now the punch surface only is alone now same click top lane click sketch and click in wireframe view so far you can get the part lines a boundary lines same like click center line as we did in die sorry okay exit sketch go to features click extrude boss like this click offset offset around 60 it's not good click 80 in here you choose up to surface here you can select the surface it is created now hide the surface and give the give some appearance to this punch here you can see the punch is ready now hide the die hide the surface also exit edit part save it simple form you don't see you don't have to save so this is a simple form tool this is not a form tool this is just a simple die and punch for this stamping part here hereafter we can develop a top and bottom plate and we can design a complete press tool so this is how it is thank you for watching this video